Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Sam and welcome to another video. For today's video, we will be testing out the new skate park in Brussels. Finally, Brussels has a proper skate park. As the capital city of Belgium, it always used to have a really shitty park in the center. And apart from that, there wasn't really any good park here. But now we have a great park. Well, great. It's very big, but it's kind of weird. But it has some really cool features as well. First of all, it's huge. As you can see, it is really, really long, really big, and a huge bowl over there. But all the modules are kind of weird in a way, like kind of out of proportion, I guess. But uh, it's still really fun to just go like super fast and just cruise some lines because you've got a lot of small things that you can hit. I'm actually a big fan of the park even though a lot of people are not really a fan of the park. Qui va skater ça? Ici, c'est quoi ce truc? A quoi ça sert? Un skatable. Un skatable. I think the park's really good. Yeah, we're just gonna skate it with some homies here. We're gonna be testing out the new park here in Brussels. Let's get it. Yo, this dude just told me to put on a shirt in the skate park. We're not allowed to skate without a shirt here, apparently. Okay, my friends, we are here at the bowl and we're gonna go for uh, 50, 50 grand to Fiki. It is very, very deep. I don't know how much meters, but. Uh, Il fait 3 mètres de haut. Qui va skater ça? It doesn't look deep. Yeah, on the camera, it probably doesn't look deep. But maybe to give you an idea, we'll throw my board down just so you know how deep it is. That's a good idea. Oh. <laughs> what a dude like. So yeah, now you have an idea of how deep the bowl is. <laughs> and the bowl was big. Hoppla. What? Stop that! Ah, uh, what is that? Stop it, man. Stop it, man. Walk it up, walk it up, nigga, walk it up. So what happens man, the bowl is big. By the way, <laughs> got the merch. Yeah, get the merch. <laughs> Buy the fuck away, nigga. We got this. Friends. So we just did the 50 to fake and then I wanted to go faster and longer, you know, that's kind of how it goes in skating. If you don't fall, you go crazier. Pretty bad smack on my hip. That's gonna be nice and uh, rainbow colors tomorrow. It's okay, I can still walk, but it's just a little bit, feels a little stiffy. Yeah, okay, let's get some more.
Okay, my friends, this is me about a week later. I actually forgot to film an outro for the skate park review conclusion. But seeing as I live only 600 meters that way from the skate park, I decided to still give you guys my full conclusion of the skate park. So as I said before, it's a weird park, very unique in a way, a lot of weird proportions. But altogether, I actually really like the park. You can go super fast. There's a lot of space. And in skateboarding, I really like to just go really fast and do a lot of tricks. It's something different, you know? It's very smooth though. The concrete is really good and the bowl is state of the art. So I think in total, I will give this park considering everything 8.5 out of 10. Thank you Brussels for the park, but please next time try to communicate with the local skaters about the kind of stuff that you have to build here because some of this stuff really does not make any sense. It's still really fun and I'm thankful we have this, but it could have been so much better for the money that they pumped into it. So that's a bit of a shame, but yeah, communicate with the local communities and that way everybody will have the best possible situation when building new stuff. Anyway, that was it for today's video. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Sashi. Don't